What's good, YouTube? It's King Wolf Play back again once again. Today, people, today, I am back for episode four of Digimon. Now, as you can see from the beginning of the video, I did a grinding montage. I, I went in today and I learned how to use the uh, how to use the Digimon and everything. So I put some Digimon on my team and moved some Digimon to the uh, island so they could level up. Uh, the Pokemon decided to go with my team. I have Digivolved since. So I started out with him, and then Digivolved into Golemon. And I started out with... Well, of course I have Palmon, but I Digivolved Palmon because the Digivolution here that I wanted her to be is this one. But a level 16 is required, and she could only go to a maximum of 25. Or, to a maximum of 15. So I had to Digivolve her, which I did at level 12, and then D-Digivolve her back to Palmon. So her maximum went from 15 to 27, but now she's level 1, so. But I'm already, I, in my grinding montage, I got her back up to level 11, so. I'm over halfway there to get my evolution. And then this one, I evolved from this thing, which came from the black, uh, from this Digivolution, as you can see. And then all these are just other scans I did that I just got in here. Uh, some of them might just be going to a digi digital convert here, where I can just pop them or not. 
explode Digimon where I can just pop them in my other po in my other Digimon to give them experience that just depends on if I run out of evolutions because I'm trying to get all I was trying to get all the devolutions and then uh that's the shop this is what I was using the train because it takes me back to that digital stream this is the online mode the recovery and here's the island they're still in training for another hour and 37 minutes. But that's all my that's all my Digimon I got right now. I can't farm any goods because I ain't got any goods to farm. But let's quit wasting time here. Um, I should probably uh, give you a little team recap. So we have Palmon, level 11, maximum level 27. Sitting at 640 HP, 31 SP, 61 attack, 48 defense, 41 intelligence, 44 speed, 74 cam, which is pretty much your happiness, at level 11. And then we got uh, Doramon at level 11 as well, maximum is 26, with only 580 HP, 30 SP, but 78 attack, 44 defense, 25 intelligence, 55 speed, and 49% happiness. And then we got Gomamon, level 11, maximum 22, 660 HP, 34 SP, 53 attack, 51 defense, 42 intelligence, 44 speed, and 49% happiness. So it looks like I have a water, a plant, and a dark that I'm using right now. And I have no reserve Digimon because I don't see the point in having more than three right now because I'm kind of beat everything. Uh, what was her voice? Do you understand the digital lab? Use it carefully to further your in interactions with Digimon. Let me see if you're the person I thought you might be. Finally, one last thing. A small token for you. I got a hacking skill. Hacking skills shine in combinations with Digimon use, but are they dungeons if used for in scriptless hacking purposes? How you use your skills is up to you. Never forget that. You can deepen your special ties with the Digimon, live with them, share their joys and sadness, and grow together. By, depend by deepening your bond with Digimon, they'll surely offer you their aid. It is a very important ability. It will even change your life. Connection jump. That's what you call your curious skill. I know nothing of this power. It's like a hacking skill, but well, different. But I'm certain... It's a skill that will serve you in unique ways. I'll see you later. Take care. Hacking skills. We're on a field press square to open the hacking skill menu. Here you can use the various abilities of your Digimon. To use a skill, the Digimon in your party must meet the necessary conditions. You can check the conditions of a skill from the player menu of your Digivice. You were heading to Kaloon, I suspect just this once, I'll let you use the special exit. Next time, oh. next time, go to the access point if you please. Commu um, commercial devices, this is the flow of, di to, of the digital world. There are reference points for the digital network that connect to locations everywhere. The half cyber Portuguese can use connection jump to move from here to Eden or the digital lab. Real worlds can access Eden or the digital lab. Eden can only access the digital lab. Alright, so we're supposed to be getting me a body. With my three Digimon team. You can eliminate so security firewalls that block your way and continue your progress. This skill has different levels depending on the of your of the firewall and you won't be able to take down a firewall if the wall crack skill isn't high enough well, good thing for me I got level one
It's me. Well, I finally got through to you. I lost your trace information and had to s search again. Where did you wander off to this time? I see. You can run into Mel Masakagu. Yeah, you could say we're acquaintances. Regardless for there to have been a natural progression where you would meet her. You seem to have a craziest luck. Let's assume you carried out your original objective. We'll start by what you've already broken through the firewall. Well done. You saved me some time. Hee <laughs> hee. All right. On the next move. On to our next move. I scanned the area around the entrance of Kaloon and marked key junk data sites. Junk data will serve as your body parts. You need to go find and retrieve some. If something uh, of a stopgap measure and it may not be a perfect solution but I'm sure your skills are up to the task this is the key stop to returning your body to normal so buck up and get to work it's okay searching for body parts isn't as hard as defeating 48 demons now is it Think of it as emergency measures. I look forward to meeting you in the normal body. This is a tool for communicating with people who aren't in the same place. You will receive messages from your friends and Digimons in your Digiform. If notified appears in the bottom right of the screen, click the touchpad button to check you receive messages from the digital Digilab menu of the Digivice. You should also reply to your messages when you receive one that needs replying. There are max level Digimons in your own. Okay. So move on, we'll go back to that we'll go back to the max levels here in a minute. Because first we need to grab these body parts, which I'll have Digimon protecting them. Registering to field guide. Scan data and new Digimon will be collected and the Digimon will register to the field guide of your Digivice. At the Digilabs, you can digiconvert and browse details of the data by making friends with Digimon through Digivolution and Devolution. It's a crit! It's a crit! These guys give out jack shit for experience compared to that digi stream. Is that you think these guys give out eight while a digi stream is out fifty per battle? Three new Digimon, but not enough scan on either one of them. Digimon all have types and ability and attributes, each of their own af affinity. A Digimon's type is shown in the mark in the upper left part of the status, and its abilities are displayed by color. During target selection, good affinity is shown with a red target ring, and bad affinity is shown with a blue. Target rings consider when choosing who to attack. There are four attributes, virus, vaccine, data, and free. Beneficial, beneficial, bad, okay. Attack from a type with good effect inflicting double damage while attacking from a type with a bad one inflicts half damage. Attacks with good attributes inflict 1.5 normal damage. Attacks using skills reflecting the ability is sad to say, or sad said skill. Water beats fire, fire beats plant, plants beat water. Earth beats electric, electric beats wind, wind beats earth. Light is weak to dark, dark is weak to light. No restrictions. Right. So I'm good on here. No, I need. Okay, okay, I need red circles. Red circles. Die, bitch. Two parts, two to go. What's a go, boys? Let's go. Die, bitch. 
Well, he gives out 16 by himself. That's it. That's good. You mother. Allies and enemies can suffer from abnormal statuses in battle. Abnormal statuses have unique effects, such as draining HP every turn or altering stats. All ability statuses are undone at the end of battle. Confused, paralyzed, sleep, stun, poison, dot, and bug. Attack, defend, intelligence, speed, accuracy, invasion, and crit. Attack, defense, intelligence, and speed. Who's attacking? You attack. Well, I was gonna check out a skill that I have, but I guess not now. And there should be one more, which is over where the tentacle monster was. Oh god. <clears throat> oh god, a tentacle monster in a Japanese game, what am I gonna do? There's items here as well that I wasn't able to get before. Yeah, in that grinding, guys, I got so many healing items just from the random encounters. It was insane. And mine. A cross combo can occur when two or more allies are lined up on a timeline. Cross combo power tucks attack and skill efforts with the help of ally Digimon. Okay, so there's chain, damage, heal, and skill. Cross combo. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Cross combos occur rates are depending on timelines. Uh, the bigger the gauge number, the higher the rate. Gauge fills as you attack, and Digimon with the higher Comradian com will have a higher occasional rate. Okay. All right, and that should give me my body back. Yeah. Oh, you. <clears throat> oh, you at least look normal again. It's not a perfect solution, but it's a big step. The objectives have been met. Come back to the agency. What's that? You don't know how to get back. Hmm. Try logging out like you always do. Since you weren't, since you went in through an agency terminal, my guess is that you should come out through one. But to be honest, in that, in your case, I don't know what'll happen until we try. In the worst case, if your data gets scattered throughout the network, I'll salvage as much as I can. But just remember, I don't have to do this. Hehe, <laughs> I'm joking, sort of. Such a quick reply on press. Yes, you got it. Reply to the person. Okay. And I gotta go back to the digital farm because I got max level Digimon. Meaning I need to digivolve. Duh, 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 digivolve. Duh, 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 duh. Digimon. Change to digital champions to save the digital world. I definitely, when I get a chance, I will come back here and get the full scans on all the Digimon here. I think I only got two right now. Oh. Looks like they want their scans now. Okay. Come on, man. Did he evolve too? All right, so we need to go here instead of the exit first. So we need to go to the digital lab. Go 
total 8 out of 9. 8 out of 13. 6 out of 9. 6 out of 13. 6 out of 13. So it's you two. I have both y'all's evolution, but I know y'all's evolution has more evolutions. Alright, so I've got two of both y'all now, which is good because you have four. And you have three. Right, let's just check real quick. Can I... Seven, seven, eight. Nine, nine, seven, eight. Eight, seven, seven. I can digivolve you right now, which I will because I'm wanting him. Eight, seven, seven. And you can digivolve. We'll just need you all when you use, so I'll get the evolution unlocked. Wow. So now you've got four potential evolutions, and you've got five potential evolutions. What I'm actually going to do here is go over here, and I'm actually going to take Gobblemon and take him to me. do that because she'll still get experience in the team but she won't get uh, uh, friendship but where her friendship is the highest all right logo as he a bitch <laughs> he, he, you made it back in one piece didn't you I, wanted, I wouldn't have expected anything different. Still, these abilities border on the un unreal. Maybe the reason you still adhere in to physical laws has to be with an intensity fear percent in all physical organisms. Hee <laughs> hee, <laughs> this is all truly fascinating. Pardon me, Kachin. There you go again, singing about me, old man. Oops! I'm sorry! I did it again! And could you stop calling me called Chin? It's embarrassing! That was my childhood nickname! Not going to happen, my dear! You'll always be called Chan to me! No matter how old you get, how or how brilliant of a detective you've become. <laughs> how long have you been there? What have you heard? I just got here. I just got here. Is something wrong? Oh, you have a client. Sorry, sorry. Where are you going to over? Were you going over a kiss? No. <coughs> no, this is well a client of sorts, though of a somewhat unconventional nature. Oh, just who are you then? I'm gonna sit to take you. Okay, let me introduce you. This is Detective Matayoshi. He's an old friend from when my father ran the agency and I trust him completely. He's the most elite detective the force has on cybercrime. Look, so deceiving you were thinking, well, I suppose I don't exactly fit the mold. But if you do, I'd never be able to tag it along with the 
shadowing element, shadowy elements. Oops, I slipped with the tongue. <laughs> so, is there something afoot, or if it's a case, sit on the sofa and wait a bit. I'll just whip up some tasty coffee. No, thank you. There is no case today. No need for coffee. I heard a rumor about Eden Syndrome. I thought you might be interested in culture. Let's hear it then. Mm -hmm. Alright guys, I'm actually going to stop right here and end the episode. And hopefully we'll get to episode 5 here soon and figure out what is going on and continue the story mode. But I'd like to thank all you guys for coming out. Hit the subscribe button if you're new here so you don't miss any, any single episode of anything I do. I'd like to thank you all for your support on my other series I started yesterday of the trip of the Road to an Ace on Rainbow Six Siege. And of course, if you know, you guys hit the like button if you new, hit the like button if you enjoyed. Live life by the sword, and I will see you guys next time. Bye.